Hey everybody, what's going on? I'm out here in my uh, sunflower field that never got any herbicide put on it. It's still only got 20 pounds of nitrogen and the great cover crop stand. I think these flowers are still going to do pretty decent for yield. I'm just out here trying to figure out about when harvesting will be. Today is December, September 17th. Yeah, I figure it'll probably be at least two, three, maybe four weeks. Yeah, probably closer to three, but as you can tell with this flower. That one's pretty green. Some of them look like this, though. They're pretty dead, right? They're pretty ripe. But yeah, you know, this cover crop out here, guys, is just amazing. So, uh, we had an early frost this year about... I don't remember the exact date. It was early in September. And it didn't hardly touch nothing out here the way it looks. So, yeah, uh, I guess that is just some vetch there again. I thought maybe that was some sun hemp. Oh, yeah, maybe that is it. Nope, that's uh, vetch. I destroyed it. Oh well. Uh, somebody told me to watch the harvestability in the sunflowers because I have hairy vetch out here and this is the reason why. As I crawl up the stalk like this. I'm not 100% sure what that's going to do in the combine. I'm hoping that it'll go right through though. Be just fine. I don't think it'll mess with the header too much. At least my header. Um, yeah, I mean, look at this cover though, guys. This is awesome. And we still got... The native bird and mosquito out here. I should have brought a shovel with me out here and I didn't, but there's a turnip. Clover, hairy vetch, grass annual ryegrass. I'm pretty sure there's some cereal rye in here. Oh. Kale. Some bigger kale down here. Yeah, and the sunflowers are a little taller where I'm at. I'm six foot three, guys. That one's pretty good. Heads aren't too bad. Oh yeah, we'll just have to see when the combine rolls through. I'm not very good at judging yield, but and for no herbicide out here, guys. There's one weed. Well, I thought that was a weed at first, but I think that's a, just a buckwheat that died. And that's it in this area. One weed and, well, at least a six foot span, probably more like a 10 foot span. I'll take that, guys. This is, that's what happens when you get diversity out here. You won't need the herbicide because the the diversity of the cover crops mother nature doesn't have to try and fill it in we've done it ourselves so yeah this is awesome guys i'll uh keep you updated more with harvest information uh, i'm gonna be combining millet first i did take a sample uh, a day or two ago it was 17.2 percent moisture yet I weighed 55.2 pounds per bushel. I don't, it's not going to yield very good. That's not a very good field. I'd like to get a combine here pretty soon though and get some cereal rye out on that because it's going in beans next year. So, yeah. Um, I think that's it for today, guys. I'll uh, catch you later. Mm -hmm.